17 minutes till 6 now, Hillsborough County leaders are taking the next step in trying to stop future environmental disasters like the spill at Piney Point Phosphate Plant earlier this year and red tide algae bloom outbreaks that have impacted our beaches. Leaders are looking to regulate fertilizer use during the rainy season. ABC Action News reporter Lauren Rosella shows what that means for households and farmers. Hillsborough County hasn't had any rules about fertilizer use during the rainy season, unlike the city of Tampa and Pinellas County. Now Hillsborough County leaders are worried that's going to have a negative impact on our environment. Biologists say excess fertilizer runoff in our waterways can cause high concentrations of nutrients, in particular nitrogen and phosphorus. That can cause dangerous algae blooms that pollute water and kill plants and animals. Now, Hillsborough County leaders are drafting an ordinance that would limit fertilizer use potentially from June all the way through November or the entirety of hurricane season in Florida. They say this is critical to protecting our waterways and stopping further spills like Point. That's the abandoned phosphate plant in Manatee County, which discharged wastewater into Tampa Bay earlier this year. It's important to, to note that even before this horrific red tide event, Tampa Bay has been suffering from the impacts of nitrogen pollution, which has been getting worse in recent years. According to Commissioner Smith, we lost more than 5,400 acres of seagrass between 2018 and 2020. It's important to point out this fertilizer ordinance would not impact any food production gardens in Hillsborough County. That includes the smallest backyard vegetable garden all the way up to huge agricultural farms or strawberry fields. Hillsborough County leaders are hoping to hold a public hearing on this issue in September. In Tampa, I'm Lauren Rosella, ABC Action News.